Yes, please. And then after thank, that, Sylvia. Thank you, Farhan. Uh, last Wednesday, there was an attack on uh, three trucks uh, running between Mauritania and Algeria. Uh, then there was conflicting report, one from the Algerian presidency that claimed that these trucks were uh, attacked by Morocco. Another one followed from the uh, foreign minister, and he said that the trucks were uh, destroyed uh, east of the berm. My, my question is, since uh, we have the Polisario out of the ceasefire, and they are operating in the east of the berm, what have happened? Did Minorso conduct an investigation uh, on that uh, issue? And if so, if there is any results uh, or not? Yes, yes. Minurso did uh, look into this. Uh, we learned of the incident uh, on the 2nd of November, uh, in other words, three days ago. Minurso then was able to send an initial patrol to the site of the alleged incident the following day, the 3rd of no uh, November. And we can now confirm that the site is in the eastern part of Western Sahara near Bir Lalu. Uh, the mission observed two trucks with Algerian license plates parked parallel to each other. Both trucks had suffered extensive damage and charring. Uh, follow up. Uh, follow up. Uh, okay. Since the east of the berm is considered a militarized zone, and there is already an existing uh, border checkpoint between uh, Mauritania and Algeria. Why did not use this uh, uh, route, the, the official uh, checkpoint? And why did these trucks have driven into a military uh, operation area? Uh, I, I have no uh, explanation for why the trucks are where they are. This is a, a matter that's being uh, looked into, but uh, but I've just reported to you what the initial results are. So from, Minurso from did not cover that, uh, that area? Not I, yet. I, I don't have anything to, okay. to report on, on that part. What what they were responding to was the report of, of these damaged vehicles. Uh, yes, uh, Celia in the back. 